Hello, it's Jim from Early Birds. It's been a while since I made a video. I've been, to be honest, I've been stuck in the how to create um, a readable or a usable sheet to keep track of profits and losses. Um, trading wise, I'm not a big trader. I have never have been, but um, you know, we all have to adapt and have a, a learn. And um, one thing I started in early January, I started having a bit of a play around and I've been messing around with it, to be honest, for a, bit, a little while. And the first thing I realized was you needed something to keep track of your profits and losses because it's so easy to get lost in, in this, all this hype. And, uh, you know, you have some big wins and your big losses and you're on just an example that I'm busy on Margex, Bybit and Wirex. Just an example, those three. And when you, I think we can all relate flipping from screen to screen, uh, project to project, you lose track of everything you're doing. And um, you sure realize that sometimes you're not winning <laughs> or, or, or you are winning and you don't realize it, one of the two. So basically, I had a bit, I started below or above this video, there'll be a link to, I'm going to post this in the Buddies Network. Maybe an early bits Facebook group. There'll be a link to download this spreadsheet. There's no charge for the spreadsheet. It's a sheet that's absolutely free from Jim. It's not a, uh, this. What you're looking at isn't uh, oh get rich with this because you don't have to do anything rubbish. Uh, this is literally a tool for for the serious people to use to keep track of your profits and losses. As simple as that. It's no charge for it and it's not some magic wand to make you money so just if, if that's what you're looking for stop the video right now because this isn't for you um but looking at what i've been playing with so here's me me results i'll show you this spreadsheet and again you can get a copy of this spreadsheet uh from the link above below the video if it doesn't work give us a pm and i'll i'll send you a file for for the sheet again there's no charge or guarantees anything like that it's just something i've been busy occupying myself with to be honest i know i needed to make the sheet to keep an eye on what i'm doing so this is what anyway this is what i've been doing so far I started trading an xrp uh so here's the chart i've made i'll show you how to fill it in in a minute so this is my results so january uh january i made 387 xrp this is all in xrp everything in here not dollars there's one dollar figure you see here total profit that's just for information really that's uh for my info but everything you see is xrp is xrp the price of xrp is something after a lot of people get confused with that as well i've noticed that so january 387 xrp profit june i didn't do anything and then July, I made 261 XRP. And then August, I made 175 XRP. And he has the percentage. So, example, August, 9% profit, which wasn't bad. 81%, uh, I think I made a couple of trades there. That's I would ignore that because 81% uh, profit, I don't think that's realistic. August was more realistic. I did a full trade in August. I got stuck into it. And 9% profit. I bit you know made some big losses big wins a lot of mistakes <laughs> i wouldn't try and pretend i'm a guru i'm still learning but uh, this like this video is about using this sheet as a as a profit and loss gauge should we say so um here you can see this is oh, the, again the sheet's all formulated so just if you get example september we're looking at just double click it and you'll see there the formulas pop up you don't have to worry about all that. I've, that's the bit I've been scratching my head at. So the, these are the figures. Um, this is if example. You put the price of XRP in there. We'll just say it's 58 cents. Watch this figure over here change when I press enter. There you go. So that would be my dollar profit if XRP was um, 58 cents, but it's not 56 cents. <laughs> so that's my dollar profit based on the total amount of XRP that I've made. Um, actually, that's not the right, uh, that's not the right sun. Sorry, uh, well, I made a mistake there because I have to add September in, in the, into that equation as well. So I'll, I'll do that as well. Don't want to forget that. I went 
backspace. Where's that? Hang on. Uh, that's not right. Auto sum that. Hang on. Auto sum is. That plus, yeah, I made a mistake. Yeah, I made a mistake there. So when you double click that, it's, it's those figures here plus September. So I just robbed myself. Anyway, um, again, this is not a magic formula. You know, if if you if it doesn't work or there's something not working, just give us a shout. We'll work it out. But it's again, it's not like a pro platform or a project. So don't start screaming at us. This is for the, the EB friends, <laughs> for sure. Say. Um, so basically, those are the profits I've made. Just check that. Yeah, August and then September. Yeah, I forgot about that because September's uh, running. Eh? <laughs> I'll go through that in a minute. So that's not a bad, that's not a bad income um, based on 56 cents. Uh, but again, that when the price of XRP changes, you just put in there the new price and then this automatically generates. So what this sheet does is, you'll see, now, this is the previous months. Um, you will need a little bit of knowledge in Excel, but again, if you get stuck, just give us a share, we'll work it out. Uh, if you look at here, everything's formulated over here. So if you double click that, you'll see there, all the formulas highlighted again. You don't have to be a rocket scientist uh, to play with it. It's yours to do what you want with. But um, let's just see. We'll start with uh, we'll start with the. You'll see here there'll be a blank sheet somewhere. We'll start with um, what should we start with? We'll start with the deposit. So we'll say Marjex again. You can find the links to the tools that I'm using. Marjex and Bybit are the two trading platforms, which is quite good. Um, I'm preferring, to be honest, Marjex is looking a bit better than Bybit. I'm using them both, and Wirex I've used for a long time. I do a lot of uh, uh, Wirex. I've got a multiply, and I use Wirex for my Visa card. So any profits I make on Wirex, on my trades, little trades, yeah, I use my Visa card to then buy me shopping and what have you. It's quite interesting. <laughs> or pay me server fees, but or domain fees, what have you. So for this one, we'll, we'll, we'll do a deposit there. I've, I've marked a deposit margex and then I've marked, uh, let's say $200, uh, 200 XRP, excuse me. So there, that automatically generate the, the formula. So there you'll see deposit, 200 XRP. And then I'm gonna put that all in trade. I'll show you where I get those figures from in a minute. All in trade and then um, in my wallet, I'll say the zero just for this example. Now, where do I get this XRP and trade is? If if you're using Marjex, it could be crypto.com or it could be whatever. I'm using Marjex as an example. I quite like it. Have a play with it. You can use Marjex anywhere in the world. No, um, no KYC. It's quite interesting. So to get that figure, I look here in orders. So this is what's in me orders at the minute. I've got 606 XRP in orders um, for this. Uh, so we'll, we'll put over here 606 just just to show you um, an example. So there I've got 606 XRP in orders and then deposited 200. So and then the difference uh, is so would have been 406. Yeah. So let's say I started with 406 because I carried it from the month before or whatever, if you didn't start from zero. Um, and then I've just deposited 200, put it in, like hypothetically, put it in trades. So now I've got 606, uh, uh, 606 in orders, XRP. I don't bother with the point, to be honest. Um, and that would give us... Um, Profit of zero because I haven't, I haven't made a profit. Eh? I, I've deposited 600. Uh, sorry, I've deposited 200. I had 406 from the month before, hypothetical scenario. 
So that would be a total of 606 XRP in trade. I've got nothing in my wallet, in my, 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 my back, back office wallet, so there's not where it is available, a zero. So um, basically that would give us a profit of zero, but that's still busy in trade, 606 XRP. Yet. So that's an example of how to get uh, how to get the, those totals. This is an example for October. I'm just giving you a hypothetical. I'm pretty sure everyone watching this can have a play. So once you've made that deposit, um, you may make another deposit. Let's just say you make another deposit. Um, make a deposit of 400 XRP, just an example. So now my total deposit 600. Total deposit 600. But I haven't put it in trade yet. So I'll just, for this example, I've deposited it. So I'll just put it in my wallet, just an example. So now I've put it in my in me, uh, me wallet. I've deposited it in my wallet in Margex. So it's now sitting in my wallet. So there's 400 sitting in my wallet. It's 200 from before. That's 600. And then uh, you get the idea. Um, so let's just say I want to make some trades. I'll put some trades in there. And my total trades move move up to 1,000 XRP. Uh, 1,000. No, that's, that's not right. Hang on. <laughs> that's too much. Yeah, so I'll add 400. I'm going to move that 400 and trade it. So that would be a thousand. And then, so, we, so that balance was, would be zero. All you have to do is reference your balances. And this is where you get your profits from. As you're building your profits, um, this starts to move. So let's just, uh, so that, you know, let's just, for this video, hypothetical, I've got that much in trades, nothing in my wallet, balance is zero. As, as I'm trading through the weeks or days or what have you, this changes eh? what's in trade and what's in your wallet because as you're closing trades, they go in your wallet. So let's just say I, 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 I close a trade and there's now 800 in there. Um, and then in my wallet, there would be um, 206. Because I closed exactly the same as amount as I had in there. But let's just say that I made a profit of uh, 30 XRP. So I, I, I had 1,006, then I closed it and I made 36 XRP or what have you. Um, I think, you have, like I said, have a bit of a play, but you'll get the idea. Um, so that would be, give us a profit of uh, 30 XRP. I hope I'm not confusing everybody. Um, have a play. Maybe we should have a, a trading school or something. I'm not sure. But uh, as you're adding, as you're adding, adding things, um, uh, different, uh, you may, may say buy bit, but it may not be buy bit. It could be crypto.com or another platform, whatever you're using. This is just for reference. But uh, you can check them out. Those are quite good. We've got quick links to add to an XRP as well. And uh, the network, obviously, and Wirex. But uh, I think the people who I'm making this video for is, is not really, please, sir, I want to be rich, help me, I've got no money type people. This is like, this is the early birds team. Um, most will be pretty familiar with a spreadsheet. But just have a, like I said, have a bit of a play, start with a blank month, download a, a, the spreadsheet from the, the server. And have a, like I said, have a bit of a play with it. But 100%, if, 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 we, if we go any further with this, I'm not sure how, where we're going to go because just an example of Margex. I'll just go quickly over to Margex. They've got, um, they've got a, um, a very good platform. I, I, to be honest, out of all of them, that seems to be the one I'm, I'm liking most. You can do a lot more with it. But you, you've got copy trading. Which is something, copy trading. I'm just again. I I, I wouldn't profess to be a, um, a a guru. I'm missing something here. My mom, what I miss? Ah, oh, there it is. Trade. Uh, copy trading. Yeah, there it is. 
I haven't done anything with it yet. I'm I'm still busy, but looking at this, we can um the example we'll say you can pick XRP as a copy trade, and then you can make a profile, and then everybody can do the same trades. So it's something I'm not hundred percent sure with. We'll have a look. But uh, the spreadsheet, if you haven't got a spreadsheet, definitely start using one because when I started studying what I was not winning or what I was winning, um, I got a shock. It's so easy to get lost, really. So definitely download the spreadsheet. Cheers.